Hello guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're gonna talk about the AS3 error on Fortnite. This is again a very common error that can come up when you're trying to play Fortnite. And this error commonly indicates a network connectivity problem. So in this video, I'm gonna show you a few things that you can try and I'm gonna give you a few advices that you should uh, take into consideration in order to solve this problem. So let's get to work. First of all, I'm gonna advise you to reboot your router or modem, whatever you have, just try and do that. Also, make sure that you're using a broadband connection or a wired connection. This is uh, very, very uh, recommended for Fortnite. And again, make sure that you're not behind a proxy server or you do not have epicgames.com filtered. If you don't know any of these terms, most likely you don't have any of these problems. So I'm gonna show you now a few things that you can try to do on your Windows operating system system. I have here a Windows 10 operating system. First of all, you're going to have to click on the start menu and then click on this icon and go to settings. Here in settings, you're going to go to update and security and we're going to disable our firewall or antivirus only temporarily because we have to see if our antivirus somehow blocks the connection to epicgames.com or the Fortnite official servers. So if you have a third party antivirus installed, you should try to disable that. But in my case, I only have the Windows Defender. So I'm gonna click on Windows Security and then I'm gonna click on Virus and Threat Protection. A new window will pop up. You're gonna see here, Virus and Threat Protection Settings. Just click on Manage Settings and then click on this and then on the user account control, click on yes. And on cloud delivered protection, again, do that. And real time protection and cloud delivered protection will be now disabled, only temporarily, as I've said. And now you should try to open Fortnite and see if the error is still there. If the problem is not solved, we're gonna try to unlock or unblock some ports. This is uh, something pretty complicated. I'm not gonna explain it uh, very, very much. You just have to follow the steps that I'm gonna show you. Just click on the um, search button and then type in here control and here will appear the old control panel. Just click on it and then go and click on system and security and then go and click on Windows Defender Firewall. And then in the left side, click on advanced settings. Again, in the left side, click on inbound rules. And then on the right, click on new rule. This window will ask us what type of rule would you like to create? We're gonna select port and then click on next. And the specific local ports, we're gonna type in here 5222, comma, and then a space 443, again, comma and space 80. Then click on next, click on next, again next, and in the name you can type in here UI4. And then click on finish. After you did all this, try to open Fortnite again and see if the problem is still there. These are some solutions that are recommended by the official Epic Games admins. So if none of these solutions worked for you and the error is still there, you should try to contact Epic Games directly. I'm gonna leave you a link down below in the description where you can contact them directly and tell them about your problem. But I'm hoping that this video helped you and the problem is no longer there. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new here and click on that that notification bell to be notified of the new videos that I post. And of course, give this video a thumbs up if the video helps you. Until next time, have a nice day.